Hello and welcome back to another episode of How to Draw. Last time, as you may have seen, we drew a duck and an owl. And this time, we are going to be drawing a penguin. Sort of a cartoony style, just like the duck we have here. It's a bit of the same style. So, hope you enjoy. We're going to be drawing a duck, um, sorry, a penguin. Then you'll see what next. So... You want to start kind of like the duck, except you don't need to put this squiggly thing at the bottom, so just make a head, just like an oval, sort of. Then same as this, but make it a bit thinner. And then do that, and then leave a space in the middle by doing that. Then... Oh, that's terrible. Then do this. I guess it's not very good, this penguin. This individual penguin. Then you can just do that. And then make the wings by adding a thing on the edge. Then. <laughs> yeah, it's a perfect penguin. No, actually, I'm going to show you what a real penguin would look like, but I can't do it with the camera. Sorry about this camera delay. There, that penguin is a bit better than this one. Anyway, that's a penguin. And I guess we don't really have any room to draw. Um, I'll have to draw a cat on this page. So, I'm next we're going to draw a cat, like I just said. This is really cartoony as well, so, yeah. Oh, I'll just take my pencil grip off you. Um... Do a circle. Ears like you would normally on a cat. Then make a, a sort of a sort of a rectangle shape down there. Then these do these sort of blobby leggy things. And that makes the feet. Then add whiskers. really derpy eyes and a tail the mini cat there yeah, it's a cat and you can like make a different kind of cats or so and stuff it's not really too hard you can play around with all these designs so um i'm going to show you one more quick design and that is called or what i like to call anyway the the improv camo and it's really neat in that you can use it in so many different ways and I actually found this out from a friend and she's so good at drawing basically make random shapes like it, it does not take skill and it looks pretty neat so she just like just try, try not to make it too repetitive but Already, you've made something pretty beautiful, and um, that's that's three more for today, and that's pretty great. Oh, there's my shadow out of the way. So, yep, now you can see we've made a kitty and some blob, camo blob, and a pain a penguin, penguin. So that now you should you can know how to draw. Um, oh, fingers in the way. A duck, an owl. Flip it over, a penguin, a cat, and blobs! Hooray, good for you. 
next time on how to draw i'm gonna be covering some keyboard art and that's really neat that you can do keyboard art so i hope to see you then please like and subscribe and share this with your friends if you want to know how to draw really dopey cat faces bye Oh wait, actually, before I go, the eyes I did here, I didn't really explain. I saw this cartoon artist guy, and he drew eyes like that, and it was really cool. So, I found, yeah, I don't remember his name, but he drew, like, a version of me, and it was really, really neat. So, you just draw a circle, and then, do that. And then I add pupils, and it looks really neat. See, look, you can, like, I don't know what I'm drawing here, you can, like, um stick figure. You can make a stick figure with these eyes, and it's really neat. So, that's the end. Bye.